Hey there witches and welcome to another time lapse video. Since last time I've been keeping myself busy. I am so bad at this. A friend recommended that I try this with um, cue cards instead of a script to try to make it a little less impersonal and <laughs> I'll be honest I'm scared to death of you. <laughs> My audience scares me. Oh my gosh. I, I mean, I want to communicate with my audience, but yeah. Yay, anxiety! Well, <laughs> well our household has been really busy lately. My significant other's best friend is in, and he's brought his fiance. I, I'm glad to have them in our house and everything, though. So, today's painting is Samuel. He is my second detailed cell shaded picture with a painted background. And I was mostly playing around with the composition, you, just the general idea about a werewolf that lived in the south, in the Blue Ridge Mountains, not like in a city, in like a tiny town, not like podunk town, like the only thing to do around here is drugs kind of town. And I just wanted to make that a reality. He's not exactly as I envisioned, but you know, I just went for what was feeling right at the time. Once again, this method was inspired by Hyana Natsu. I will remember to include a link in the description below. I think I forgot to do that in the last video, so if you don't see it there, I'm gonna fix it. Don't worry, we're gonna take care of that. All right, so today's talk tum, talk topic. I try to say Tumblr and topic at the same time, so as you guessed, today's topic is Tumblr. Yeah. Tumblr, I mean, that was a site that was near and dear to my heart. I enjoyed it. I'm, it was it was a good mellower. Um, yeah, it's about two weeks ago now. Tumblr got taken off the Apple Store because of child pornography incident. I don't know any details about that, but that's what I heard. And that was the beginning of the end, let me tell ya. So they decided we're gonna take out all the pornographic sites, anything that's not safe for work, blah blah blah. I mean, this included even kissing tasteful nudes, it's just the whole shebang. And you know, of course, there's gonna be the hentai mangas that are getting taken down, and the. They were trying to get the bots, um, let's just say that the bots that were subscribed to me trying to get me to click on their websites, I never saw them get flagged, okay? <laughs> they, they, they kept going. They weren't going anywhere. So, they decided on December 17th, they were going to institute this whole We're going to be kid friendly, yup yup, and do the thing so, To get back onto the Apple Store If only I knew It wasn't people It was a pre-programmed algorithm, often called a bot That was put in charge of finding that not safe for work content it did a shitty job, okay? It did a really, really shitty job. It couldn't tell the difference between a penis and a finger. But yeah, the bots are badly broken. What did get flagged were pictures of Shelties popping out of blankets, um, screenshots of kittens, um, any kind of clothing. I mean, if it was on a mannequin, it got flagged. Uh, Lord of the Rings memes, a uh, watercolor abstract of a deer, a vase, <laughs> a vase got flagged as is inappropriate. <laughs> what? What? In the, um, oh my god, what? Why? Yeah, well, anyway, the way the ban was supposed to work was that it was supposed to flag photos, videos, and gifs of human genitalia quote, female presenting nipples, unquote, sex acts, and illustrations of sex acts. What the f- What is female presenting nipples? This is like, ka -ching, I'm just gonna show off my nipples, just look at it, just do like finger circles around. What, what is that? What is a female presenting nipple? Like, if you get someone that's a transgender female, then is it considered a female presented nipple? P female presented nipple. I really want to know this because evidently another thing that the algorithm did was flag everything tagged lesbian, LGBT, queer, asexual, ace, pansexual, everything. It, it, it flagged the whole schmeal. And supposedly, um, classical statues and political protests were supposed to be excluded from the spam. My good friend Zerdy. Her Tumblr mostly focused on news blogs, news stories, human rights, working conditions, and gender identity. Her blog got taken down after December 17th. 
But the thing is, in the stipulation, classical statues, classical artworks, and political protests were supposed to be excluded. But her, her post got taken down. A lot of communities and rem blogs that the commu communities for LGBTQ plus, I, I'm not sure the proper uh, acronym for that. So please forgive me guys, I'm, I'm still educating myself, I'm trying. But yeah, a lot of them have been getting taken down because I followed them because I support the issue. I support trying, you know, be, be yourself and find like-minded people and they got taken down. Where are these people supposed to go now? It's awful. Before the whole huge ban slash whole, like the bots were going to go 100% full-on on December 17th. So I joined in the protest to log out for 24 hours in protest. And as soon as I logged out, my account was flagged as inappropriate and sensitive to minors. <sighs> I, I mean, my mind was blown. Um, how is a 2D character artist and animator who uh, at, at most does a, a tasteful nude that's not even showing anything? She's hugging the moon. It's, it's an abstract. You can see, you can well you can't see it on my Tumblr anymore because you can't see my Tumblr. Uh, you can see it on my Deviant Art. There you go. My sister the moon is the artwork in question, apparently, or it. Maybe it was the key flag? It itself never got black flagged. The only reason I can think my account was taken down is because I participated in the organized protest. I was very pro-choice, pro-human rights, pro-you are all people, let's treat you like people. And um, I got taken down. And because my, po my, my blog is now completely hidden from my followers, I have no way of telling them to go to my other social media. They can't even access my page where I have links to my social media. I can't even access my page. I myself cannot look at my own blog that has no titties, that has no sex, that... It, it, all right, you know what my blog doesn't have? It does not have photos of genitalia. It does not have videos of genitalia. It does not have gifs of genitalia. It does not even have female presenting nipples. The one nude I have in there, her breasts were covered. I have no sex sex. I am not a not safe for work artist and I am perfectly fine with not safe for work artists but it is not my cup of tea. I had a commission from hell that was not safe for work. I will not do that again. Illustrations of sex sex. I did not have that. I had, I had none of it and my Tumblr got taken away from me. I, I was actually sort of neutral but understood the danger so I joined the protest and I got my Tumblr taken away. At this time, I can still access my followers, I can still access people I follow. So I finished going through my followers and connecting with them on any other social media that they have, at least the followers that are still there, not the, I can't access the ones that got flagged anymore. Their, their sites are down now, even though their icons are still there. And that sucks. And I'm going through the people I follow and following them on other social media. I probably should have done that to begin with, but they were on Tumblr and I used Tumblr I, I used it every day, multiple times a day. It, it was my jam. It was my relaxation. I would watch videos of yowing Siamese cats and look at pictures of Shelties and read the latest anime news and read the did you know facts. But yeah, I, I can't. I could continue using the platform, but that would be supporting what they did to me, and what they did was wrong. Because I wasn't anything that they were trying to ban, and they banned me because I joined the protest. That's the only reason I could think that they decided to ban me, and I will never go back. So, I've already deleted all the side blogs there. You may be able to see my name on there, uh, you may not. I've still got to update my social media and get myself taken off of being on Tumblr on any of them, but... It's a process. I have a lot of media. Yeah, this, this I, I told you guys I'd do something a little more lighthearted, but this just, it, it blew my mind. And it's still blowing my mind because I didn't do anything wrong except join a protest. Freedom of speech. That's the only thing. And it sucks. 
Well, I've hit about the end of my time here, so I hope you enjoyed watching the speed paint. I hope you like this new format. Let me know what you think, okay? So go out there, make something, and keep creating, even in the face of adversity.